Excel has a spell checker that you can use to spell check your worksheet. To do so, first select the sheet that you want to spell check and from the review tab on the ribbon, click the spelling button. Excel will spell check forward of where you are positioned at the moment. So if you're prompted if you want to continue checking at the beginning of the sheet, you should click yes. If there are no spelling errors, you'll be advised of this. But if spelling errors are found, Excel will indicate this to be the case and the spelling dialog will open. The spelling error is indicated as being not in the dictionary and Excel is giving me a number of suggestions that I can choose from. Number is of course the correct word. So I'm going to click change to change this misspelled word with this suggestion and it's now been fixed. Excel has located another instance of a word that is not in its dictionary. Now if this is a word that I commonly make a mistake with typing, for example if I often mistakenly type it as I-T-E-A-M, then I can have Excel autocorrect this in future. I'll click the correct spelling and I'll click autocorrect. In future, any time I type I-T-E-A-M, Excel will automatically autocorrect this to read item. And I can do the same with quantity if this is a word that I mistakenly type quite often. If you use this autocorrect option, you'll find that over time you can actually reduce the number of spelling errors you have in your work because Excel will autocorrect the commonly mistaken words that you type. Description is not something I typically type incorrectly, so I'm just going to change this. And now that we're done, Excel is confirming that the spell check is complete and I'm good to go. The autocorrect feature can also be accessed another way. You can choose File and then Options and then Proofing and then Autocorrect Options. And on this Autocorrect tab, you can type the text that you want to replace and what to replace it with. So you can use this for words that you commonly mistype and when you add them and click OK, they'll go into the same list so that Excel will automatically replace them if you make that spelling mistake again. And as I mentioned in an earlier video, Excel only spell checks the currently selected worksheet. So if you need to spell check multiple worksheets, you should select those before you launch the spell checker. To do this, click on the first sheet to spell check and then control click on each other sheet that you want to spell check at the one time and then click to launch the spell checker.